Feeling hypnotized by the words that she said What's up? It's Rin with another video. I'm just covering up my address in my green mattress because I was too lazy to tape it up. Um, yes, so this is my Corgu box. It is massive, as you can tell. Um, yeah, it's huge. It just arrived, and I want to go ahead and open everything because this is a haul video, but it's not all of my stuff. It's a combination of my stuff and a couple group orders that I did. Um, so yeah, we can just start and uh, pop this thing open and see what's in it. Okay, um, so this is the box. Wow. Oh my gosh! So this is everything that comes in it. I am going to blur everything out because I'm too lazy to tape things up. But wow. Wow. Oh my god, I see some exciting stuff. So this is what a Corgu box looks like. This is my first one as well. So I'm not a professional. This is definitely going off of my first experience, what I've learned. So yeah, this is my first box that I've ever gotten from Corgu. Um, so this is like a consolidated package of all of my packages that I've been ordering. Um, so yeah, I've been ordering a lot of stuff from Weavers, from Big Hits releases that were only to Korean addresses, some Bong, Bong Con um, pop-up stuff, and then some sales that I bought from Korean sellers, and then some other um, BTS uh, haul that I did just because I was already ordering stuff on Weavers. I figured I might as well make it a thing um but i will say shipping was a lot but i'll get into that kind of later so let me just take everything out of the boxes and i mean out of this large box and then we can go through everything all right so this is everything that i got kind of set up um just i laid everything out but we'll go through one at a time so yes now that things are getting back to normal it's kind of odd i've get, gotten two hauls in a row and usually i like have monthly hauls but I, yeah it's about to be overloaded as hauls so let's zoom in and start with the first one um yeah i think i really like corgu this is my first experience using them and i was always curious how geo managers um or like group order managers ordered from korean addresses and i'd always see people talk about corgu and i wondered what it is so i looked it up and i discovered that corgu is a proxy server that allows you to order things so it's very simple to sign up all you have to do is log in with a valid email address create a password and as soon as you log in they will create a korean address for you so it's a it's a warehouse i believe so they'll give you your own address. Be the same address as I'm pretty sure everybody else that has Corgu is because it is Corgu's address. And then it'll give you like an apartment complex in a way. Like it'll give you a specific number room that is yours. And that's how you order things to Korea. And when you get things shipped to you, you have to be very specific when you're ordering. Um, well, first off, let me backtrack a little bit. So when you order from Corgu, um, Corgu will also uh, give you a warning that if you use the address, you have to make sure you're typing it in very specifically. So you have to type it in exactly how it's given to you, which luckily when you go on the Corgu website, there is a tab that says my Korean address. And then it'll also say how to use your Korean address. So you want to click on that and it'll give you specifications on how you can type out your address. Yes, I've said address five times. And also there is a verification process. You do have to send them a photo of your ID. I believe. I believe. Yes. Um, there's also Tenzo, which is a Japanese proxy server that gives you a Japanese address, which I might talk about in a later video. But that requires you to send in two proofs of identification. Um, but I don't think Corgu does. If I'm wrong, I'll leave it somewhere here stating otherwise. But I don't think that it does. So after you get your address, it's easy as one, two, three. As long as you're entering it in your address properly, then when you get shipping notifications from Weavers or whatever app you're usually, probably Weavers, um, if you're a fan of BTS, then... Uh, it's as simple as that then you can simply just 
use the address provided to you by Corgu to order your items and they get shipped to you a lot faster. Um, and we'll talk about shipping costs in comparison later. I'll probably have to do a voiceover for that part at the end of the video, but so far I'm happy with Corgu. I, I'm just happy I was able to order merch that was strictly in Korea without having to go through hoops of finding other geo managers. It's directly sent to me. So if that's too much work for you, you're more than welcome to still go through geo managers. But yeah, so hi, let's get into the unboxing. So I've took everything out of the boxes. I've just talked a lot. I don't even know if I hit every nail that I needed to or every point that I needed to make. Yeah, but how are you guys doing? So yes, okay, let's start here. The first thing I got, if you can notice, is the, it's so pretty, oh wow. Oh my goodness. So this is from the Bong Bong Con Pop Up. It is the hat that Jungkook wore for a couple of the Love Yourself concerts. It says BTS World Tour on it. The Love Yourself hat. Yeah, I love Jungkook in this hat. I think the other members may have worn it as well. I just vividly remember Jungkook wearing it. Tag. It's in really good condition. Okay, so I also got the... I got two of the Wings ticket album. So I'll open one of them. So if anybody is interested in any of the solo photo cards, I'll probably put those up on my page or if you see this video feel free to leave a comment or DM me on my Instagram. So this is the photo book or the ticket album. And this is from the Wings Tour, the trilogy. Wow. It's like matte. It's like the map of the soul tour that they're releasing recently with the matte effect. I'm so here for it. It looks so good. So it starts out with the Wings symbol for the tour and then you can put tickets in here kind of like that so you can just slide them in here you could probably even put photo cards in here it does also come with a folder in the back where you can put things in here and that's about it the reason that i got it is because of these photo cards so whoa so cute Look at Namjoon, Namjoon. <laughs> he looks so baby. Wow. So handsome. Yoongi, he's so soft hair, black haired Yoongi. Jin, wow, these look like this. They're kind of matte, and then the photo part is shiny, and the back look like this. Then we have J Hobi. So baby, Jimin. And Taehyung and Jungkook, which I already have this, so I might have an extra Jungkook up for trade. But let me see if these fit in here. Oh, they do! Look at that! Wow, look at that. I won't keep them in here, but they fit. So that's so cute. So I also got the Wings Tour Sicker set. Yes. So... Wow, whoa. So it's still in pretty good condition with the Bong Bong Con, the pop-up merch. Whoa, this is a fat stack of stickers. Um, a lot of the stuff sometimes might be in bad condition. They did forewarn people that the conditions might be... We don't know what the conditions are like. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So good. Uh, but these are in pretty good condition. They're just curved. Tay. John Cookie. And then the whole wow. G -co Jen Cook. Jen Cook. So cute. This photo. The wow. next thing I got is the the Wings Tour paper paper frame set version one. I got both versions. So yes, I'm excited about that. So I'm gonna open them side by side so we can see the comparison. And this is the Wings Tour Paper Frame Set version two. Wow, okay. So the frames look the same for both of them. They come with a black frame and then a couple white frames. Yes, so you get, wow, so many frames. Five. I guess there's five photos in here. I would assume so. And then one, two, seven uh, smaller frames. And we'll look at the black version first. 
Like I said in my last haul, I was so shocked that they released the Bong Bong Con pop-up merch. Whoa, look at these photos. They're so good. So this is Nam Chuni from this set. Kyungi from this set. Wow. They're so cute. Jin. I love these photos because they're printed on actual paper and the paper says their names on it instead of like photo paper that um yeah wow hobi he literally looks like the sun in the sky <laughs> around clouds speaking of clouds the clouds are covering the sun and that is making my lighting so bad okay we have jimin tay so sultry and cute and then baby jungkook i'm so happy to have this rare set and then we have Vimin, the cutest duo his little mustache i'm obsessed we have soap best unit best boys oh hobie's trying to steal yugi's cloud and yugi's just like he doesn't even recognize that that's happening and then we have namkook jin such a cute unit look at the ass his big fat ass cat all the boys shook. And then we have the group OT7 Cloud Boys. So adorable. Sorry, you can't see. So cute. Oh, that makes me so happy. And then we'll look at the other sets. And this is the other set. So we have Namjoon again being a whole cutie with his cloud. And these still call him Rap Monster, which I think are funny. We have Yoongi, Soft Baby, Jin, so cute, Hobie, yes, Jimin, and Tay. This era, Tay, not okay. <laughs> we have Jungkook, like a little fetus, so cute, it says Jungkook. And lastly, we have the group. So these are the two groups, Femen. We have the two soap units, yes. We have, Ho I mean, uh, Nam, uh, you know, you know what I mean. Nam Cook Jin, <laughs> cuties. And we have the group photos for this set. Oh, I love this one, the one that with them lying down. It's so precious. Hobie eating a cloud. He's so cute. And then the boys here. So cute. Wow, I'm so happy I got both sets. I feel like when I started collecting, I obviously missed the wings era. So it's I'm so lucky that they started to they did this so that me as well as other army oh my god i think the sum's coming back me and other army were able to get a lot of merch that we wouldn't have been able to otherwise so this is the wings tour poster stamp seal i'll just open one because they're both the same things but i got an extra one because um, when i was opening the weavers app there was still a lot of stock and i just got it in case other people might want it and i'll resell it to other people um, yeah, I know usually I just work on my collection, but I know a lot of people, again, with the virus, weren't able to order a lot of merch that they were releasing, so I just got some doubles to help out other people. Wow, this is so hard to get! I was so shocked that it wouldn't sell out, um, considering that it's really hard to find people selling these, but they're so cute! I will never use these things at all! <laughs> Jin, Hobie, Jimin, Tay, Wow, and my baby Jungkook. And I will probably be keeping all of these because when I get OT7 stuff, I can't help but. And then the last, the Wings Tour set. Actually, I'm just kidding. There's some photo cards here that I'm excited to go through as well, but. I got the Wings Tour 2017 BTS Live Trilogy Episode 3, blah, blah, blah. Yes, it's the face photo book. And I've seen some case sellers sell the perforated part. They'll tear it apart and actually just sell the photos individually. But I would never. Rap Monster. Rap Monster. 
so good. Wow, you can get your face with this Art Gen Yes Gel Line. Work. Sorry, I'm not doing this well. Like, I don't want to mess up the spine, so I can't really open it while practice mine. And that is not okay. Kobe. Oh, it has your signature. I mean, they're um, wings symbols that were specific, never specific. Kobe, certain face. Jimin, certain face. I'm sorry, I'm going to skip through this a little bit. Just so this video isn't too long. Oh my god, don't compete. I'm not going to go time. Of course, baby. Wow, I love these clothes ones. They're so much. Uh, nice okay, so the next thing I got are the Wings Tour mini photo cards. Um, I got two of each because that's all you can order. I'm surprised I even was able to get these in my cart because these are very hard to buy nowadays if you're trying to collect old merch. So I got version one and version two. So we will open them both. All right, so this is what they all look like. Yes, I really like the packaging for this merch. Just gonna open them all, all at the same time because why the heck not? Wait, are these white? Oh, <gasps> whoa, <laughs> summer white and summer black. Oh, what the, okay, I didn't know. Okay, so yes. Okay, so they all look different so far. Oh my god, I'm excited. Okay, so we'll make room. These are the black sets. This is the white set. And this is this. So we have, first off, we have Namjoon. I love him in this shirt. I've never seen him in this fit. I like the blue background as well. So these kind of look matte. And they're matte on the back as well. Yes. Four of A, we have Yoongi. So cute. Seven of eight. We have Jin. Yes, we have Hobi. We have Jimin looking so cute. Tay, what a baby. And my baby, Jungkooki. So cute. Oh my gosh. And then we have Soap Unit. So I'll probably be keeping the units and junk hooks, but I won't be keeping the other ones. So this is the other white version. We have Namjoon again, eight of eight. So four of eight and eight of eight. And Yoongi, wow. They're both different sets. Jin, Hobi. Jimin, so cute. All V, three of eight, and my baby junk hook. And I have bought a whole set, so you will see this. I'm trying to go through this merch fast. I love this group photo. I am obsessed because I'm trying to go through this fast because the sun is going away. And yeah, so I'm sorry if I don't talk about things too much. So this is the black version. Oh, okay. So this is true. The black version is shiny and the white version is completely matte. If you can tell the difference in the material. Yeah, you see. So that's good to know because I've received some of these before and I didn't know if they were authentic or not. But yeah, we have Rap Monster. Yungi. And they are considered two different sets, I believe. No? One of eights. One of eight. Interesting. I'm not sure. One of eight. I'm not sure. J-Hope, eight of eight. Oh, yeah. So the white set. Whoa. Army during the wings were probably going broke because the white set had eight photo cards. And then the black set had eight photo cards. So, like... You were probably going broke if you were trying to get... So that's a total 16 photo cards for each member. Look at this smiley eggy. Look at him. His sm eye smile is so cute. Tay looking so fine. And then we have my baby Jungkook and another soap unit. And it is different than this soap, I believe. And it, they're both three of eights. So that means there was 16 photo cards again to have collected. We have Namjoon. Again, I will be selling all of my extra um, member cards. So if you're interested in any of these, please pay attention to the numbers because I'm not mentioning them. And my baby. Yeah, I think I have a couple of these already. Well, this has a scratch in it. Oh, no, it was just a hair. So cute. And then we have V-Men. Yes, my favorite group photo is still this group photo. So good. 
Wow, okay, so I'm gonna put these away. And I already bought Jungkook's full Love Yourself set from a K-seller before. Um, so I just got more photo card set because I could and they weren't sold out, you know? And I'm trying to collect the group photos, but the first thing I got was Jungkook's key ring. I didn't even try to get um, photo pickets because I don't collect photo pickets, but those sold out really quickly. Yeah, and a lot of the Wings Tour t-shirts sold out super quickly, but this didn't sell out too quickly. This is such a beautiful keychain. Look at little junk cookie. I love this photo set. And the next thing I got were two photo card sets. So let's see what pulls we got this. So we have two sets here. So we have Namjuni here looking so good. I love Yoongi in this set. I love this whole set, the flower concept, the veils. They look super ethereal. Jimin, Tae, Aww, and Jungkook. And then I got Bimin. Yes. Why is V biting his lip beside Jimin like that? Right in front of my set, 11 out of 12. So there are 12 group photo cards. I don't have any group photo cards, so... I'm pretty sure I'll put all the other groups, I mean members, up for trade um, or sell, depending on oh, the sunflower hobby, holding a sunflower or multiple sunflowers. Okay. And baby junk cookie. And then another V-Men set. My chingus. Yes. Okay. It's all the merch for the Bong Bong Con merch. I'm actually shocked. I thought I had more than that. So I already have one Love Yourself tier album and one The Wings album. Um, I have version I for The Wings and version U for Love Yourself tier. So I got W N G for Wings. And I also got Y O R. Yes. Okay, so I got all the albums open, so we'll start with the wings. So I like the wings set because there's only one um, set. <gasps> Hobie! Yay! Wow, baby! I needed Hobie's too. His signature is so pretty. Is that a eyelashes with wings on it? That's so precious. J-Hope's signature is my favorite. Aww. I love him. So we got a J-Hope. And I only have Jin and Tay at the moment. <gasps> Jimin! Yas! Big hit! Dude, I love ordering from Weavers. Like, I always get good pulls from Weavers. Personally. I don't know about you, but I do. Wow. Wow. Jimin's signature as well. Yeah, I only have Tay and Jungkook. <gasps> and Yas! Okay, sorry, I'm so excited. And I got Yoongi. This is perfect. Yes, what a good array of photo cards. Yes, and wow, look at this album. Oh, this is Jungkook's version. So, wow, look at him on a bed like that. Mm -mm, my thoughts just went somewhere they shouldn't have gone. Okay, so with the Wingsy tier, we have... The notes and everything it comes with all of this jazz <gasps> jiminy this is my first um love yourself tier y version photo card and it's jimin looking so fine that makes me happy because we all know how maknae line is so hard to find trades for and collect in general yes all right next up we have the R version. <gasps> Hobie! Oh, what a precious eggy. I don't know if I have any other um, R versions aside from Jungkook's. Can you focus? So, yes. This makes me so happy. And I did just buy t or trade taste in my last haul, you saw. So, now I have Hobies. That's super exciting. And lastly, we have version O. So let's see. <gasps> yes. Oh my God. This fine snack. Wow. 
such good pores i'm obsessed yay okay the next thing i got from my for you address is the mouth of the soul um jigsaw puzzle set so this is the map of the soul 7 set there is also a persona set which i have coming in the mail which i'll do a haul for soon so yes let's just get right into this i love this set so you might have seen unboxings for it before so it looks kind of like this it has a hollow effect and how do you take it out okay so you can take it out all the set like this and they're in a little holder let me move these photo cards before i damage them so yes all four sets come like this and there's also a um i won't go through the post well maybe i will let's just open one to see why is this box bigger maybe it's a bigger puzzle but it comes with the glue to glue the um puzzle together and it comes with a little stand i guess um, i don't know but yeah but it looks like inside of these boxes we have the map of the soul 7 version 4 version 3 version 2 the swan version and version 1 so that's all for versions and then the reason that i got this set is because of the postcard mini clear file and photo card that come along with it so yay wow that's so pretty it's a holographic photo of the adorable jungkook edit drawing photo oh and there's a clear file in it what do people even use clear files for because i know with japanese releases that um sometimes the pre-order benefits are clear files and i'm like what why would i need that but yeah this is what the clear files look like they're really cute and they have this like plasticky material wow wow so good whoa i like the coloration on this photo it looks really good wow and then version three a whole snack oh <gasps> whoa okay 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 we'll look at the photo cards in a sec well actually i might as well just look at them now whoa wow the coloration of this is so gorgeous so this is what it looks like on a white background they look so good and then on a black background wow then we have version two wow that's so cool. Wow. And I like how it has the BTS symbol. You can really see it on the black background, but also on a white background. That looks so good. And then the version 3. Yes. I can, oh, I'm sorry. Are we uncovering you? Oh, yeah. And version 4. These are so pretty in comparison to a photo card they are a little bit bigger if you can tell yeah but still so adorable i'm so happy i got this set and lastly it does come with postcards which are so adorable as well whoa they all have this holographic effect can you see that rainbowy effect like you can see it really cool in person that is so dope do all of them have that i'm not sure so this is the version two, I mean version three. Yeah, it kind of has the rainbow wee effect. I think, I can't, maybe, I can't really tell because the photos are black, but these two have it. Wow, so dope. TXT's Dream Chapter Eternity, the end of a trilogy for TXT. I still don't have the one of the versions for the dream chapter magic um oh god but uh, i did want to pre-order these wow from weavers because they come with pre-order benefits stan bts stan you have to stand txt it's just like 
a package. Not technically, not literally, but for me, that's... I'm not gonna lie, one reason why I like to so much. Uh, yeah, so let's unbox everything out of the album. I've seen the unboxing for these and the album is so gorgeous. Um, and yes, so let's start with the posters. Wait. So I got one set, which was pretty cheap to order on Weaver's Korea. Look at them looking so fine for little boys. And then the, this set, yes. They look so good. Very handsome young men. Speaking of handsome young men, um, there's been rumors that TC might be in Kingdom. So Kingdom is the real Korean reality um, K-pop show. Um, there was Queendom, which had big groups like um, Idol and Zamamoo and Park Bomb and... Um, I think it had some other girl groups that I can't name. I am so sorry that I can't think of them right now. Um, but yeah. So this is the pre-order benefits that it comes with. A postcard set of the boys. And the back looks like this. And these cool pouches. Actually kind of good. Like I could put a whole bunch of makeup in here. This is big enough to fit uh, like a whole... Um, oh, this one's bent. A whole... Look at their... Look at them. They look so good. Sorry. I got distracted. A whole eyeshadow palette. That's what I'm trying to say. I can't think of it. And then the albums themselves. So let's slowly... So this is what it looks like. And this version... Wow, I did better than that one. A set of keys comes in both. So each album has its own two sets of keys. Which is very interesting. It reminds me of Fake Love Era. Um, where Jungkook's item for the magic shop that was given to him was the key. So, you know, Big Hit Universe all tied together. Okay, I only need one set of keys. So I'll put this in a safe place so I won't lose them and get locked out of the album. All right, so um, recently I discovered that Hyun Kai is my bias, um, just because he's a whole cutie, a whole eggy. So I'm hoping to pull him. Let's flip through. Wow, oh, Taehyun, I really like the. Uh, I really like Can't You See Me, the title of the album, as well as Puma is good. But my favorite song is the last song on the album, Ah, uh, Eternally. Is it Eternally? Yeah, Eternally is so good. Eternally is so good. And the song that they wrote together is also really good. And I like um, Shampoo, Fairy Shampoo. You know what I'm talking about. You know, I like the, them, that song. Um, but yeah, those are my favorites. So it comes with a sticker set, What Cuties, and then this postcard. Wow, that's just, this is really pretty. Their artists are so good. And looks like I got little Bumgyu and Subin. Wow. Subin is so cute. Oh, I'm going to scan that before you can. Haha. -ha. And then Taehyun. All right. And we'll use the key for this one. And this version looks like this. Little babies. Can't You See Me is really good. I like that they're going a different route for them. Not like that um, schoolboy happy music. That's my generic version of it. I'm not very good at describing things. Um, but I really like the route that they're going. I really like music in general, like eternally, that have two different melodies to it. So there's like the music's going one way and it changes. Yeah, I don't think BTS has any songs that do that. I like that TXT is trying new things. Um, which is, it's fun as a listener to see their progression. And I like Slow Rabbit's production, so we have, oh, Yeonjun, blonde hair, yellow haired Yeonjun, and <gasps> my baby, 
my little eggy. He's just like the maknae of Big Hit. He's so adorable. Oh, can you focus? Hello. Yes, what a cutie. I also wanted to do this unboxing because I have other people's photo cards here that I want to go ahead and get to them. And I need to calculate EMS pricing and stuff. So I want to go ahead and get this to them so it's no longer delayed. I just received this package on Saturday. Yeah, so only one day ago, I guess. It's Sunday today. So, dun dun. This is... Let's find out. So, I ordered from four different um, Korean sellers, I believe. <gasps> Yay! Aww! Yay! Oh, wow! Yes! Wow! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. Oh, so exciting! <gasps> Are these freebies? So, I think this is a freebie pack. We'll open this first because this looks like a whole stack of freebies. Whoa. This seller I have two packages from. She is a sweetheart. So I first saw her post under the hashtag here. Um, if you're wanting to buy stuff from Korean sellers, so this whole um, video will help you with that. Set up your own Corgu and then learn how to navigate through Korean Twitter because um, that's where K sellers are. They are not on Instagram. They are on Twitter. You can get stuff so much cheaper there than buying from rebuying from um, U.S. sellers. Whoa! Look at these freebies. So cute. I love them in the Chuseok um um Chuseok outfits for the Bang uh blah, 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 BTS Run episode, the one where they were playing all those games. I know we also got wow Yoongi and Jungkook. So cute. These are so good. Look at these photos that she just printed out for me that she gave me. Wow. Whoa. Wow. Oh my goodness. Absolute cutie. Wow. Jungkooki. Wow. <gasps> Yay. Thank you for all the junk hooks. It's literally. Wow. She's so sweet. She gave me so many. Oh my God. I just passed out. I died. Oh my God. This is an edit, but imagine. <laughs> imagine. All right. Don't imagine. You'll pass out too. Don't do that to yourself. Um, we have Love Yourself Cheer. This little babe. I am so happy. And she gave me some <laughs> Yoon, uh, Yoon Min sets. This Love Yourself Tear photo as well. Oh my. So beautiful. I could frame this photo. Wow. And look at these like. Um, packaging that she put it these in. They're really good. I don't know her name. She's so sweet. Like, because I was using Google Translate to talk to her. And, um, she would start using, uh, English because she knew that I was... I had broken Korean. Yeah, but you gotta get that Papa Go, you know? Jungkook taught me well. Pop go to Papa Go if you ever worry. I personally think Papago is a better translator than Google Translate um, yet because there, it offers you an honorific um, option for translation as well as um, like a, a informal um, version. So, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please. Okay, the sun is gone. Should I turn on the ring light? I might as well. All right, the ring light is on. I'm sorry if that it hurts you. So the first thing we have is these very, very rare photos. So this is what attracted me to her post initially because I saw baby drunk hooks. I was like, yes, I need these. These are from the canceled muster, the 17250 um, muster. They're the live photo prints. Look at this baby. So cute. We have John Cookie looking. His hairstyle is so cute. So adorable. This is the full set too. Wow. Honestly. Wow. So cute. And then this one is so cute. So these are what I bought from her. And then I posted her post on Instagram. So some of these are for other ARMY um, that 
wanted to join the go and this is a wings the final photo card for an army two of six we have yungi three of six and we have a unit 12 of 15 from the final i think that's mine and these two are for the for the globe droners and then i have some clear uh, lenticulars from the Festa Moodlight, which actually the Festa Moodlight was re-released on the Bang Bang Con pop-up, but I wasn't able to get it before it was all sold out. But luckily I had already ordered these from the K-seller. So I got John Cooks for myself and these two are for the same army who ordered this, I believe. John Cook I mean Yungi and Jimin. And then we have a another unit. Yoon Cook, wow, 3 of 12, which I think is different from the ones that I pulled already. Yeah, because I too pulled V-Min ones, so that's exciting. And then I also got a binder um, ticket. Yeah, the Wings for Ticket that you saw me open earlier in the set. Um, she was also selling a Jimin one, which somebody bought. And then the Jimin Wings in perfect condition she kept these really, really well. The corners are perfect. Everything looks so perfect. And I pulled him as well. Yes. Put my Twitter name, Rin7. I got the little 7 still in the name. I'm not really on Twitter too much. I just retweet things. I don't ever post anything. So I never am on there like that. So this is the next oh okay this is also another really sweet seller um i think her name is fantastic fantastic 12 30 i believe she's really sweet so i got something i said i'd never start to do which was collect broadcast pcs but she had the full persona set and the fake love set but john cooks was claimed already but i managed to claim this this is jungkookie whoa wow do i want to take it out not really i'm gonna leave it <laughs> wow i never thought i'd collect broadcast pcs this is a start of something start of something new i feel so right to be here with you look at him what a baby and she also gave me some freebies, some Jungkook freebies, because I sent her too much money. So she said she'd include some stickers. Wow. Look at his wet hair. She cook. Look at these. Aw. Wow. This photo. This photo when they were at UNICEF. Oh. Ugh. Best photo Oh my god, what a cutie. This is like the most recent one. Ugh. Ugh. The way he progresses from being cute to just like a whole dime piece. Two more packages. I believe this one's a big one. Alright, so this is the next thing. I got... Whoa! Okay, so this was from a another K seller. She wasn't as nice as the other two K-sellers that I communicated with. She was very abrupt and, um, you know, um, yeah, you can't, like, whoa, do you guys see this? Okay, she was very short um, and taciturn, so I was, I talk with a lot of Egyo, so when I was speaking with her, she was just like, yeah, these are the photo cards you want? Okay, yeah, this is how much it costs. Send me the money, thanks. Um, I was a little shocked and worried that she wasn't an authentic seller because of how she was talking to me but um all my photo cards arrived but i would have ordered more i was just like let me just order a little bit and you're gonna see the stack and be like that's a little bit um but i uh, ordered less than i could have because she was selling her entire junko collection i wanted everything that she was selling but i was like no no just get a little bit in case she is a scam but she wasn't so <laughs> yay good for me um wow okay so she just put them all in the sleeves which works perfectly i don't even want to take everything out but i will okay so the first thing i got from her guys you know how expensive this jungkook version 2 photo code goes for it goes for like 30 40 dollars sometimes um which is ridiculous the album doesn't even cost that much but yay she was selling it for super cheap 
and I had to snag it. That makes me so happy. He's so baby. Look at him in his soft, the fuzzies in his outfit. And then his, he's just so cute. Wow. I would have posted this on Instagram as well, but be, like I said earlier, I just didn't want to post it because I wasn't sure. But yeah, I'm just taking everything out. The first thing I got are a couple wings sets from her. So these are the all the white versions. So I need to work on my black set because let me pull out those photo cards are really like blingy. The white set, okay. These two that I pulled just now. So I have two of eight and six of eight from my sets from Bong Bong Con. And then I bought from her one of eight. Three of eight, four of eight. I think I already have this one from another seller, but five of eight and six of eight and seven of eight. Wow, so I have, luckily I pulled one that I don't have, so that's good, but I did buy a duplicate one, but yeah, wow so cute and then i also these are also rare af this is the hyyh epilogue on stage tour i have one of seven and four of seven yay and the last thing i have something that i never thought i'd get she gave these to me in a sleeve so i can just keep the sleeve i'd have to flatten it out but oh my god these are kind of hard to get out wow wow whoa this is also rare AF. Y'all know these are the clouds set from the muster. And this is the Korean muster. I bought the whole set from her. So we have baby Jungkook in his little cloud bottle. I could just eat him right up. <laughs> and then we have Jungkook doing that. Wow, so cute. And then we have John Cook again. I hate this lighting so much. I usually like to only do natural lighting. And then this eggy. Wah! Never thought I'd get this set, but here we are. We live in. I'm here for it. And the last package feels like a fat stack. So I'm just gonna cut her open. And this is from the K seller who I got this set from. So let's see. Whoa. Mm, look at this lenticular. Wow. So this is mostly from the Go. Um, a lot of these are not my photo cards, but let's go through the freebies. We have this cute Tay Lenticular. Oh my gosh. So adorable. Oh, Vanilla Sky, Tay Tay Land First Eviction. Oh, okay, that's a fan site. Wow, that took me so long to think of. So, and then a bunch of stickers. Stickers, Hobie and Tay so cute wow their fits oh wow we have jin yoongi namjoon and jimin jimin hobi we have yoongi being a little meow meow and then we have fan art we have the wings for set but i don't oh huh I think I'm missing photo cards. What? That's odd. I'm missing a whole bunch of photo cards. So the next things I got are the um, second muster, the official second muster, the a full set. Wow, from the two two nine twenty. Yes. Wow. Look at him. Wow. And then a little Tay, she was selling a whole set. I'm probably gonna keep, actually, I think I've already, no, I'm probably gonna keep this whole set. I did have some people claim it, but I don't know if I've sold it to anybody yet. Ah, look at this unit. But I also have um, another, the wings set, the white set. So let me move some things out of the way. So this is for my friend Ashton. Um, he bought the whole Yungi set from me. And then I have this, another duplicate. Girl, I just saw these and I was like, I'm gonna buy them. Another duplicate. 
Yoongi. This is a new card, but I think I already had this card. Eight of eight. I do already have this card. Yoongi. Wow. This Yoongi set is so adorable. And then I have a duplicate. Oh, no. Yeah, I do have a duplicate. Wow. Wait, I'm missing a whole set of photo cards. Uh, I just realized I'm missing a whole thing of photo cards. Um, which was mostly for the go. There was a whole bigger go that I did that I bought photo cards um, from one of the, my the sellers. And I don't know where they are. So I'm going to have to check my Corgu and stuff. But yeah, I'll just get to describing more of Paceable and Corgu um, near the end of this video. So please stay tuned if you want to watch that and learn how to get yourself all this Korean merch more easily and pay less. But that's the end of this haul. I'm sorry if it was chaotic as always, but thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate you. Bye! Okay, hi guys. Welcome to VoiceOver Rin. So we are at Corgu, and this is what Corgu looks like. You can also use it on your phone, but if you're going to use the website, it's pretty straightforward. It does only come with two language options, so I'm going to choose English, obviously, um, and then that translates everything to English. And when you get to Corgu, the first thing you want to do is register, of course, if you haven't used it before, and it's pretty straightforward. So when you get to the registration page, you'll just need to have your email, um, set up a password, put in your full name. For this part, I just put in my name again in English, and these are all the countries that can use Corgu wherever you live basically you can use Corgu as long as you can speak English and Chinese since those are the only two languages that Corgu has on their website and yes put your zip code in as well as you'll put your address here in this section your actual address where you live so the that's where your packages will get delivered to and the last thing is your contact information your phone number and you don't need to put Facebook or Skype and then just click register so I've already done that, so I'm going to go just log into my Corgu. Once you're registered, you'll pull up to the main dashboard. So it'll automatically give you a Korean address um, and you can see your unique Korean apartment number is basically what I refer to it as. It's just like your specific apartment number. So when you live in an apartment complex in the US, for example, there might be many people who live in the same building address as you but your specific number is what yeah your specific apartment number is what makes it your apartment obviously so yes that is what this number here is your unique identity number so that's the most important thing that you'll need to remember mine has a letter and then some numbers and that needs to be in every korean website that you order from it should make make sure to have that or you could lose your packages when they get delivered to Corgu. So that's something to keep in mind, but this is what it'll look like. You can click on Korean address here. And this is where it will show you your free Korean address, which is made again as soon as you register. Um, it'll have your Korean address. It'll also have your name here. And yeah, everybody's address is mostly the same. Again, the most important part is this room number that is what classifies or differentiates your address from everybody else's address at Corgu as well as you get your own mobile phone number so for most Korean websites that you're ordering from Weverse whatever it may be it requires you to have a Korean um, phone number as well to place orders so Corgu provides that to you as well um, it can be kind of confusing knowing how to put in the address since when you're using Korean websites to order, you'll need to put it in Hangul. So that's a whole nother thing where you'll have to probably either copy and paste it into whatever website you're wanting to order from. Or I always use Google Chrome because Chrome has options for you to um, translate your text to i mean to english so you probably need to that's a whole nother thing you need to be able to know how to do is navigate and know how to translate korean like where it's asking what is the city what's your the name like what is asking for what so that's a whole nother thing it does take some work but this i'm just going to show you how to get to koryu and how to make up your own address or what i do is i have um 
I've turned on the language, Korean language, in my phone. So I have Hangul as one of the as one of the keyboards in my phone. So it makes it easier for me to type up my Korean address on websites when I'm online shopping on my phone. Um, if you ever have problems with your Korean address, there is a step-by-step -step guide on how to input your Korean address. So you can click on that if you need help. Once you start ordering things to your Korean address, there's the, your package forward tab. So in your package forward tab so this is what your package forward tab will look like mine obviously already has some arrived packages and some i already have forwarded here as you can see it says forward done um but these are just ones that just recently arrived and i haven't um, processed them to get forwarded so when you want to forward things you just click on whatever packages you want to forward usually you're going to be forwarding all of them um, but pay attention to the date when they arrive because Corgu only holds packages for up to uh, 30 days. So pay attention to this date. You want to make sure you don't extend it or there is a really expensive fee. I'm not sure what it is, um, but it's pretty expensive. So check all the things you want to check and apply for package forward. So you play package forward application. So once you apply for that, there is a package forward order area and it will have your package forward order number as well as its status so these two are already forwarded but if you had just applied it would say i mean application in process or something of the like um and once it is accepted by corgu and they have processed or looked at your consolidation form then you'll want to go back to your dashboard and when you go back to your form there will be a balance in korean one so you can put money here, this is how you pay Corgu so that they, this is how you pay for your DHL cost. Um, but let me go back once again. I didn't explain something. One thing I meant to say is when your package is done, status will change to accepted and then it'll say total Korean won. So that is how much you'll need to pay for your DHL shipping. So you see that was that says 200,000. That just means $200 um, in USD. So that's how much I had to pay for that and this one was 103 so that's where it'll say how much you owe them um but if you need help with conversion fees you can go to you can go to the step-by-step -step guide on how to input Korea address in and put in say 103 or that much one um it'll tell you about how much it is in usd that you need to transfer into your Korgu. so then you can take so then you can take $98.66, go back to your dashboard, add money, and add in $98.66. Yep. And then just press pay now and then it'll the money will show up. Okay, and then the money will show up here 103,001. Uh, um it'll show up right there and as soon as you put it in, Corgu will automatically take it out to pay for whatever you owe them for shipping and then as soon as it's paid for, they'll ship it right to you. Um, the other thing that Corgu has is the assisted purchase. So this is where you can do Korean domestic money transfers to pay to pay Korean sellers for merch or whatever it is that they have that you want to buy from them. So they will usually give you the name. So this is like the name of the bank, which will probably need to be put in Congo. So there's like Cookman Bank or Gwangju Bank. There's like a lot of different banks. Um, the seller will probably tell you what their bank is. And you put their account number, which will be like a long account number like that <laughs> and their name so Lee Sumin put it in Hangul of course and the amount of money that you want to pay them in USD and you can submit that and again you can use the this currency converter if they tell you that what you owe if your Korean seller were to tell you that you owe them 100,000 won you can just put in 95.79 into here and that will transfer 100 won to them but Koryu is very expensive it costs about five dollars here it says assisted purchase fee is up to minimum fee is five won which is close to about five dollars um and the assistant payment service is also five dollars which is kind of expensive so i so i was fortunate enough to have a korean seller introduce me to paceable she whenever i was about to pay her she said paceable is a lot cheaper um, this would be a good option for you. It's really easy as well. 
basically all the steps that I've told you are in Corgu are the same for Paceable. Paceable also has a Korean address system as well. So I have a Korean address with Paceable as well. Um, but I've been using Corgu because I know more about it. I might try to use Paceable and do a review on this just to see because Corgu has as you guys saw has been fucking up people's order like they messed missed a whole package in my order biz um but luckily I was able to get that package they found it they just forgot to put it in my my first forwarding it but I got it um which you'll see in another unboxing but yeah I think I explained everything I'm gonna end this voiceover now if you have any questions feel free to DM me. Oh, by the way, Paceable is better because it costs only $1 to ship um, to transfer money instead of $5. So you don't want to pay $5 for a photo card and then pay $5 for the transfer fee. This is only $1 transfer fee, which is a lot less. Whew. Okay. I think I said everything that I need to say. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you. Bye.